boys and girls watching and right here, I have something really exciting to share with you today. I want to show you something. I brought with me a rock. No, no. no it's not a rock. What is it? It is a quarter, it's money. This is money right here, but this particular one is a quarter. We talked about things today that started with our new letter Q. What does Q say? <laughs> and a quarter, say quarter. <laughs> quarter. Quarter starts with our new letter Q. So when you say the word quarter, say it quarter, <laughs> it starts with that letter. Well, let's look at the quarter. What color is it? <laughs> It's silver. It's silver. That's right. Isn't it pretty? And look who's on the front. Let me turn it around so it's not upside down. Look what it's on the front of it. Do you know who's on the eagle? Well, no, there's no eagle on there. Now, uh, there used to be an eagle on the back, of course. And still today, you will find quarters that have eagles on the back. Do you know why they put an eagle on the back of a, doll, of a quarter? Because the eagle is our national bird for the United States of America. What is our national bird? The eagle. No, listen to the question. You weren't, let's see, you're not listening to the question. Sit up straight and tall. Hands in our laps and listen to the question. What is our bird for the um, United States of America? What's the bird called? Eagle. Eagle. So our national bird is called the eagle. The eagle because it's strong and brave. And so that's why they wanted to put it on the, e on the quarter. So sometimes you will still find a quarter that has the eagle on the back of it. But you will always find this president that's on here. This is George Washington. Say that. George Washington. He was the very first president of the United States. Who was the very first president of the United States? George Washington. George Washington. That's right. And he is on the quarter. Now, let me show you this big quarter. This is just paper money that we play with sometimes. But this way you can see it. But it looks just like this one right here. But it's just big so you can see it. And this is George Washington. And the quarter says United States of America. And it says liberty. And it says in God we trust. Because we do. We love God and he loves us. And so that is what's on the front of our quarter. And you will always find our quarter, Connor, that looks just like this. Now, on the back now, you will find all kinds of different pictures. And they look like the different states. Sometimes it'll say Florida or Michigan, or it just says all kinds of different things. So it's really neat because each state has its own quarter now. So that's kind of neat. That's really is. Now, do you know that a quarter is 25 cents? How much is a quarter? 25 cents. It is. It's 25 cents. You can use a quarter for lots of things. You could go to a vending machine. Do you know what a vending machine is? Where you could go to buy candy or you can buy a soda pop and you can put your quarter in there. Nowadays, it costs lots of quarters and you'd have to put lots and lots of quarters in there. And then you can push a button. Sometimes it has numbers. Sometimes it has letters. And it'll tell you if you want this kind of candy, you have to push this number or this letter. If you want this kind of candy or chips or something yummy, then you have to put this if you want this kind of soda or water you can push this number and then after you put your quarters in and you push the button then your thing will come out sometimes you have to watch and it twists around like this and then it goes drop and it drops down and then you can reach in and you get it and that's what you would use a quarter for maybe you've gone to the mall before and they have a carousel and you put your money in the carousel and you can ride it or a horse that you can ride and it goes up and down like this, but it's just a pretend horse. But you put a quarter in it and that's what you would ride. Sometimes they have all kinds of different ones. Maybe they have a dolphin. When I was a little girl, my favorite one was the dolphin and I would pretend that I was in the water and you'd go up and down on this dolphin and it was so much fun. But at the mall, they have all kinds of different fun things. Different malls have different things, but it's so fun that you could use a quarter. Now, how much was a quarter again? 50, 25 cents. How much is a quarter? 25 cents. 25 cents. Now, let me show you this. This money has our president, George Washington, on it, too. The very first president. This is a what? A dollar. A dollar. Do you know that four of these, four of these quarters is the same as this? So you could either have this, which is a dollar, paper money. This is paper money. 
or you could have four of these and it equals the same thing. So if somebody says it costs a dollar and you might say, but I don't have a dollar. You might not have a paper dollar, but you might have four of these. How many of these does it make one of these? Four. I just told you. Four. four. How many? Four. four. Good job. It takes four of these. So this is paper money. This is a dollar bill and this has George Washington on it either on it too. And if you turn it around, there is the eagle. The eagle is still on the dollar bill. And when you look at the dollar bill, it has the number. It says one on all the quarters corners. It says United States of America. It says that on both sides and it has numbers and it's all green just like that. Some people say show me the green and that's what they mean. They mean the money like this because what color is the quarter? Green. Silver. Silver. That's right. But what color is the dollar? Green. Green and green. And who is on the dollar bill? George Washington. George Washington. And who's on the quarter? And he was the, the president of the United States of America. Yes, and this is paper money. And you know what we call this? We call it a coin. What is it? Coin. A coin. So these are coins. So somebody might say, how many coins do you have? And you can count your coins because it's not paper. It's coins. Like if you have a penny, pennies are coins, dimes are coins, nickels are coins. This is considered a coin. A quarter is a what? A coin. A coin. Let me show you some other money too. Look at this. Whoa. How much is that? Do you see the number on there? Ten. There's a ten. Wow. That means ten of these. If you counted out ten of these, one, two, three, and you had ten of these equals one of these. Isn't that cool? And look what's on here. Let me show you this one. Do you see this president right here? This president is Abraham Lincoln. Whoa, yes, and he's on the $5 bill. Who is he on? The $5 bill, that's right. And look at this one, here's the 10 and a five, and you know they go, there's a 50 and a 100. There's even a 20. Oh, there's lots and lots of money. But most important today we want to learn about is what is this money? A uh, dollar. And who's on the dollar? George Washington. George Washington. And who's on the quarter? George Washington. And a quarter is a what? A coin. A coin. And how much is a quarter? Four dollars. Stop. A quarter equals how many cents? Four. Twenty-five. 25 cents. It does equal four to do one of these. It does. You were right. But if I just had one of these, how much is it? 25 cents. How much is a quarter? 25 cents. So maybe you could look at your house and see if you have any quarters. You could look under the couch. Sometimes under the couch cushions, there are monies under there. You could be looking. Or maybe you have some of these kind of coins in your piggy bank and you could count and see how many quarters you have in your piggy bank. Oh, it is so fun to learn. And I'm glad that it starts with our brand new letter, Q. What does Q say? Good job. Well, boys and girls watching, I hope you had fun learning about the quarter today. Maybe you have some quarters under your couch that you could find today.